Now let's talk about the stream function which is denoted by a symbol psi. Okay. So it is again a scalar function and this is also in space and time such that its partial derivative with respect to any direction gives velocity component at right angles to that direction. Now this means if I find out the partial derivative of psi with respect to x I will get the velocity in y direction or in z direction as well. So to eliminate this you know confusion whether it is uh, in y direction or whether it is in, in, in z direction this psi is only you know defined for a two dimensional flow defined for a two dimensional flow this means I will only have x and y so this would be v and if I find out for y it will be minus u all right now again for a steady incompressible flow the continuity equation becomes this isn't it so I will put the values of u and v so it will become minus curly by curly x into curly psi upon curly y plus you will have curly by curly y into this would be curly psi upon curly x now this is but obviously equal to 0 ok this means that if your stream function is existing ok then your flow might be a rotational or it might be rotational so the existence of a stream function does not tell us about a flow being a rotational or a rotational but it tells us that there is a possible case of a fluid flow that is the fluid is definitely going to flow if the stream function exists all right it might be rotational it might be irrotational but if psi it satisfies the laplace equation it satisfies the Laplace equation then yes the flow has got to be a rotational so make a note of that ok so this is a very very basic and an easy topic to understand remember this that whenever the stream function exists you cannot tell whether the uh, flow is going to be rotational or irrotational but you can tell that there will be a definite case of a fluid flow then if it is satisfying the Laplace equation then the flow becomes irrotational ok so I hope you understood this now let us move on to the next topic and talk about the equipotential line